Hey guys, Cam here from today's iPhone.com and this is just a quick tip to show you how you can create message response templates just by using really short codes in your keyboard. So let's say for instance someone calls you when you're in a meeting or you're busy at lunch or you're going to bed and you just don't want to be disturbed. You just want to send a quick text message to, to tell someone you're not available but you don't want to do it with the least hassle possible. Now. There are obviously respond templates available when you have a call and you don't want to answer it. You can tell your iPhone to send a quick message saying you're not available, but those are templates set by Apple uh, and you can actually send them yourself. If you go into general, and this will work with email or text message as well, it doesn't really matter because it is a keyboard shortcode, so it will work anywhere where you can type a message. So you go to general, you go to keyboard, scroll down to the bottom and you can add a new shortcut. Now the phrase is up to you. So I've just created a short message and it basically says, sorry, I can't get to you right now. I'll call you as soon as I get a chance. Best cam. Now you can use this for all sorts of things. Let's say you get emails from people and you can't respond straight away because you're out with your phone and you want to say something like, um, I, sorry, I can't reply to this email right now. I'm out and about I'll give it more time as soon as I get back in my office just something to let them know that you've got the email you want to make sure they know you've read the email and that you will give it your attention now this is really useful for that because it doesn't take up any time apart from when you're setting it up like this so use a couple of letters maybe three letters that you normally wouldn't put together um, and then all you have to do is obviously remember that so let's just put uh, let's put QSQ I can't ever think of a time where I would need to use that. And then you save it. And you can see my new shortcut is available here. Now, if I go into a message, for instance, uh, I can then, let's just choose, I'll just choose what to send to myself here. And then what I need to do then is just tap Q, make sure it's lowercase, Q, S, Q. And you can see my short message shows up in a speech bubble. I select it. I, I Sorry, I press space. And you'll see that my message is right there and it's worked. And I'll send that. And like I said, you can use this for emails, I guess. That is what's going to be the most useful thing here, especially for me. If I've got an email from someone at a PR for a company and they want to chase up on a product with me or want to get in touch with me, then I can use this kind of thing to send them a really quick email but without taking up any of my time but still letting them know that I have received. So let me know if you find this useful. Uh, leave your comments in the, in the comments below or you can ask me anything you like on Twitter. I'm at TIP underscore Cam. I will see you again soon.